It's the day before the graduation Woo! party, which is the day before graduation. So Katie and I were thinking that we might do another tent. Was well, so you can join in on Katie's. Yeah. Just join Katie's. Yes, we're go. Exactly. We got we're, to meet Kaden and sit down yeah. talk with him. It's only been like five years coming. And she giggled so much she peed her pants and had to run out of the room. Kaden got it on the hook. Oh, good morning, everybody. Mm. It's the day before the graduation Woo! party, which is the day before graduation. Everybody's getting ready. Brennan's doing the happy dance. It is another day in which we excel, Mikey. Dan and Kim are here. Uh -oh. I love it. And Dan, and they're, they're babies. And they just went off to see some friends. But Dan left us behind some pumpkin scones. I can't tell you. Did Brian, did Brennan try these? Pumpkin's his favorite. Brennan, did you try these yet? Okay, good. Oh, my gosh. Ryan can't even talk. That's so much going on. All right, Mike, we have a busy day today. What is going on, Jill? Today is grocery shopping, which I Whoa. just did at the grocery Woo. store. Now I have to go to the Sam's Club. Then Brennan's going to do some things, make some deliveries for me, pick up some tables and chairs and tents and all that stuff. We'll set up. Wait, me and Brennan have a tanning thing today. Huh? The things that strong people do. The things that, exactly. I put Brennan on the strong job. Brian, yes. So much. Ryan's going to just <laughs> eat. <laughs> I got all of our, not all of our, but some of our serving dishes out, some of our decorations that were left over from Brennan's party last year because, well, it's the same high school, some pictures and, and stuff college. that we'll put together, and college, exactly, oh my gosh, we put together, we're going to put together a picture table, so it's all very, oh, I guess Mike's eating the watermelon we were going to use for the watermelon salad. Thank you. Thanks, Wish Mike. I Right. And we were going to yeah. put it right in that little boat thing there. So mm -hmm. I guess that's not going to happen. Maybe Dan can grow some watermelon. <laughs> Dad's a little jealous because Dan just whipped up some pumpkin scones out of I nothing, out of nowhere. Family. He did. <laughs> How about that? Mike, could you do something good today? Do something <laughs> like miraculous maybe? <laughs> Kate, are you excited for your party? Yeah. She has two other graduation parties you, tonight. My schedule is strict. I miss grad parties. Put on some clothes. Aww. Go to the gym. You miss it or you missed it? I missed it. She's not, she's you miss it. She's yeah. It was awesome. It was. Well, she's you can join in on Katie's. Just join Katie's. Yes, she's go. Every grad party. Exactly. Yeah. She would love it. I'm graduating freshman year. Yes. I think that makes sense. Mm -hmm. And you know all of her friends anyway. Katie, yeah. I'm sorry. What is your schedule? Is it um, I'm exciting? I'm going to put on some clothes and then I'm going to go to the gym. And then after I go to the gym, I'm going to come back and I'm going to shower and then after our shower i'm going to throw on a bathing suit and me and brennan are going to get some rays so that we look good tomorrow at the graduation Ow. Day. and at graduation that just hit me and then <laughs> there are that, any child and then after that, that i have so i'm going to set up for the grad party with you guys for like three hours because mm -hmm. then i have a graduation well, we party at four that's, what you that's it we all live in a yellow submarine that's right brennan was just jamming the beatles it was great all right i'm gonna go so we can eat some of these i am already chewing Bye, everybody. <laughs> I guess all the party planning really <laughs> took ow, a toll ow, on ow, these ow, two. Ow, ow. <laughs> <Four more. laughs> Katie, yeah. why do they have to be that way? Mom, sometimes I think that I should be the only one in college. Do you think so? Oh. <laughs> what? I did. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> So with Katie's graduation coming up and her and Ryan's 16th birthday and his confirmation, all of these things that have been happening this season, we have so many memories that we've been making and we just want to preserve every single one of them. I want to live every moment and I never want to forget them. And I feel the same way about when I hear my parents tell me stories because I know that we're living a similar life that they lived. I mean, obviously different generations, but same type of things, you know, growing up and being teenagers and, and going off and getting married. One of the best gifts I ever gave my mom um, was StoryWorth. It's the opportunity for her to really write her story, the story of her life into a book. Each week, 
an email is sent to her with a question that I get to choose. Um, there's a whole bank of questions you can choose from, but I wanted to make sure to customize the questions to have her write down those stories that she's been telling me throughout the years and telling my brothers and sisters throughout the years. So I'm going to do the same thing for my dad for Father's Day. So I'm so excited about it because he's been watching mom write her stories. And I know dad has a ton too, because we ask him all the time, tell us about when you grew up on the farm. Tell us about when you went to college. Tell us about when you won the NCAA wrestling championship. Like we want to know everything. And those stories are so important for me and my brothers and sisters and my mom and dad to preserve and to sort of, um, send down the line and create a legacy. So for the grandkids and the great grandkids to know those stories is, is the best gift they can give us. Um, this Father's Day, if you would like to share a story worth with your father or a father figure in your family, this is a great time to do it. So this is the story worth book. And this is a sample that they had sent me when we um, ordered it for my mom. So this is a custom picture. So you get to choose the picture that goes on the front. And then it says a collection of stories, Judy's life stories, because my mom's name is Judy. And then you open it up and there's samples of like questions. And then you can ask the questions and then they answer them throughout. And then you also upload photos and they'll put photos with each one of the stories. So it is phenomenal. My favorite thing is every Monday morning, I get an email from my mom where I've sent her the, the question last week and then she answers the question and I get to read the story as the, as the book is being um, prepared, as I guess as the book is being written really. And one of my favorite stories so far, she tells a story about when she was in high school and I hadn't heard this one before while she was in class and this boy named Bruce, who I'd never heard of before, would always try to make her laugh. And one time she giggled so much she peed her pants and had to run out of the room. I laugh out loud when I read it, but there are so many great stories coming across from her. So I'm excited to do the same thing for my dad and I hope that you have the opportunity to do the same thing too. So go to storyworth.com slash the Donnellys to save $10 on your first order. I know that if you give it as a gift, the, your dad or the father figure in your life is going to absolutely love it. And so will you. All right, I went grocery shopping. Katie made some salads. Mike took care of the grounds. Brennan and Ryan were doing the uh, pickups of all the chairs. And I'm starting to decorate. The party is tomorrow and we are getting there. I'm sort of moving things around, kind of just puttering around in the backyard because it's such a gorgeous day out here. So I'm trying to figure out, I'm trying to decide if we should put the tables underneath another tent. We have a second tent. If people would want to sit under a tent to eat, there's certainly not enough tables for as many people are going to be here, but I think people will be mingling and it's a bit of, going to be an open house. So people will come and go. Um, so Katie and I were thinking that we might do another tent with tables uh, and maybe move the food. So anyway, it's all coming together beautifully. In the meantime, these guys are relaxing in the cove. Oh, Caden fell asleep right there while he was playing the guitar. There's Mike <laughs> watching golf right there. And I'm there's TV outside. Katie. I like that. He's watching TV outside. He feels like he's at a resort, which is nice. I like it. I'm at the resort bar. You're at the resort bar? Yeah. Excuse me, can I get some peanuts? <laughs> you have any popcorn? Kaden got it on the hook. Kaden got it on the hook. got it on the hook. You're a good guitar player. You guys, they were just playing, what's it called? That hook game? Tiki. That's a, I feel like this is pretty generic. Yeah. You know. A game, right. Or like washer swing. Well, yeah, exactly. Swing washer. And Mike and Katie must have played for half an hour, didn't get it on. And then he realized, he realized that the string wasn't long enough, so he stretched the string a little. Next thing you know, Kaden. Got it on the Rocked hook. it. Got it on the hook. We're gonna call this song Caden got, got it on the hook. hook. Well the the first Jane part the first part is Caden Wait, Kaden, it's never Kaden, going Kaden. on. Never going on the it's hook, yes. On the hook. And then part two the is Caden got it on. <laughs> <laughs> Katie was um singing the whole time. It was very funny. Making up her uh, so you guys have a graduation party to go to? Yes, yeah, we we're do. an hour and eleven minutes late. Delaying a little bit, yes. Yeah, so we're having an enjoyable time here. I'm not saying you shouldn't go. Wait I think they delayed because we're having an enjoyable time. Here. Yeah, it's 5:11, and yeah. Kate starts 11 minutes ago. Oh my goodness! It's graduation party season. Excellent. Are Simone and Kate coming tomorrow? They're both invited. Fantastic. All right, we'll see how that shakes out. Yeah. Excellent. I think I'm gonna run to the grocery store again for the third time today and get some food to make for tonight. You're quite the mom, you know that. You think so? She's a super mom. Aw, oh, thanks, Katie. Kate. What? 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 He's not complimenting you. He's telling you what to get at the store. Oh. <laughs> he wants me to get him popcorn. All right, I'll go get you popcorn. Do you guys want to go to the store and then come back? 
I know. Okay, sounds good. Alright, I'll be back. Time for dinner. <laughs> oh, I like your bow. Hello. Oh, Wesley. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh see, it's really, really bright. Is that too bad? Yeah. Thank you, Kaden. All right, you guys, we have... Just don't oh, look into it or you'll see spots. For don't look into the time. light, everybody. Okay. It's dark, dark out here. We had a fire going and... We ran out of... We fire. ran out. We've been out here for hours. So we ran out. We ran the um, really propane out. Yeah. So now I have to film with the light on. I'm sorry, Dan. Oh, don't look. Don't look. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> We've been... What have we talked about so far? Dream vacation. Yep. Uh, Who'd want to interview? Cool animals. Cool animals. Yeah, cool animals. For an hour. <laughs> We're talking about marbles. We did. Earlier. I tried to keep my ground by switching over to war documentaries. So it didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> he went to bed. <laughs> Brendan has since come home from work and gone to bed. Ryan has since come home from his boat trip and is gone to bed. Is the couch really going to bed? or? I think he's probably going to stay on the well, couch. If you don't move, then yeah. Because I don't think they have any intentions of moving off the couch. Okay. So. He's still in his clothes. Yeah, Brennan in his work clothes. Brennan. 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 He's still in his work he clothes. He doesn't. He's... Since he's come home from college, he's not the most hygienic. But oh my gosh! You should edit that out. Yeah. He was before, though, right? College is really what. Yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah, really. All right, you guys. We're gonna share what made us happy oh, before maybe we just keep it on me and Kaden because we feel bad. You're like blind. Okay. Yeah. Well, blind, don't I don't want to like. It's like we both. Like, All right, let's do it. All right, we'll do it really fast. Think of what made you happy, Dan. What made you happy, Dan? Oh. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was worse. <laughs> What made me happy? Oh, man. I, honestly, I just loved being back here. Yeah. I, it was so fun driving down the roads and seeing all of the green because we haven't been around that. And then just seeing all of the wonderful people. Yeah. Like, it has been five years since we've been Oh, my here. gosh. And to see no these kids who truly were kids... Um, graduating high school. Graduating high school and, you know, really defining what they want to do with their lives and just hearing them talk about what they're excited about. It's Aww. It's been really cool. It's That's good to be awesome. Back. That's it's awesome. Good. That's how you do what made you happy. And we that are... is... And my, oh, and my kids' here. prayers. My kids' prayers are awesome. Yes, they were <laughs> really, really good. good. Oh, I oh, cool. am going to go when it's my turn. Okay. Yep. Kimmy, what made you happy today? Um, I have to echo my loving husband. Uh, we had kind of a little reunion, so we got to have a few gymnasts come, and that was really amazing. And then uh, ice cream outside, perfect <laughs> weather, chatting with wonderful people. It was like the cap to a perfect day. I got to go to the mall. <laughs> the I got crazy makeup. animal sounds out there. <laughs> yes, I did. <coughs> oh, I that's always a good day. Great. We bought cute clothes for our kids. They're going to look so cute for Katie's party tomorrow. <laughs> candy. Okay. got candy. More, I got more to meet Kaden. And since yeah. I was talking with him, it's only been like five years coming. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've been seeing Kaden in person. The so that made me so happy. <laughs> I've been dying. So... So many happy things today. Oh my gosh, it's a good one. Yeah, it was a great day. Great day. Kaden, okay, what made you happy today? Uh, getting to go to the graduation parties to celebrate with everybody. That's fun. And getting to hang out with them, yeah. obviously. <laughs> and um, hanging out with Katie, too. Of course. Always Kaden's answer. Is it? Yes, it always is his answer. <laughs> I think because Katie expects it. Yeah. <laughs> He's At doing first his I didn't, and then boyfriend duty. Most important. Um and yeah, just getting to chill all day. It was nice. Fantastic. I don't think we really did chill all day, except he did have a nice nap downstairs. He oh, did. Yeah. He played the guitar and oh, lulled I himself to sleep. Yeah. Yeah. I said give me a picture of you. I hope you don't oh. mind. I'll show I it to you. So adorable. I'll show it to you. Um what made me happy today was a lot of things actually. I had a very great day today. This morning, when I went shopping with you, Mom, mm -hmm. I had a really good coffee from Starbucks. Good. And I got to use my Starbucks cup for the first time, which yes. made me happy. And then um, playing the game with Dad downstairs, the washer <laughs> game, was great. And making up that song on Kaden's guitar was fun. <laughs> and um, what, what was in between that? The graduation parties. Uh, seeing our friends was really fun. And then when we came back, 
to all of our best friends here. It was so much fun. And we talk, and we still will be talking yeah, after, after you guys finish. go away. But um, <laughs> you guys go away. The ki- Scotty and Wesley's prayers were the highlight of my entire day. It was like the cutest best prayer I've ever heard in my entire life. So that really is what made me happy today. Aww. Everybody's having such a good day. What about you, Mom? Oh, thanks for asking, Katie. Oh, oh, that's a bright light, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> How'd you do, why'd you do that? <laughs> oh, so many things made me happy today. I could go through a whole list, setting up for Katie's party. Um, that's it. I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Setting up for Katie's party, certainly being with Kim and Dan and the, and Scotty and um, Wesley, totally great. The weather, amazing. So it's so nice to be able to sit out here. We sat in the cove earlier. We sat up here and enjoyed. I loved our dinner. I thought that was fun and good. Dinner, and so do you good. like that? Yeah. And and just being able to hang out um, and visit makes me very very happy. And and the anticipation of the party tomorrow we'll get to have even more friends come in they get to meet kim and dan and they get to um see each other so my parents are coming tomorrow which is very exciting so thank you so much for watching you guys we hope you enjoyed today's vlog comment down below what made you guys happy today and be sure to tune in tomorrow it's going to be a big one take care bye for the latest in live happy and it's the donnelly's merchandise visit shop it's the donnelly's.com thanks for watching be sure to thumbs up and subscribe see you later